the watergram wheel. The saturation index is a mathematical calculation made to determine if pool or spa water is chemically balanced. Balanced water should prevent damage to the vessel's surfaces, equipment, and piping caused by corrosive or scaling water. Water with a saturation index between negative 0.5 and positive 0.5 is considered balanced. Taylor's unique watergram wheel will do this math for you. By dialing in the test results for calcium hardness, total alkalinity, and pH, the saturation index, SI, can easily be determined. When water is found to be outside the recommended range, indicating it is unbalanced, you may also use the watergram to play with different treatment scenarios to see which of the chemistry factors makes the most sense to adjust. Playing with the hypothetical changes is faster, easier, and far less expensive than adding chemicals and waiting to see the impact. Balanced water. For this demonstration, we will be using values that will give us a saturation index that indicates the water is balanced. Before using the watergram, use your Taylor test kit to measure the calcium hardness, total alkalinity, and pH levels of the water. Set the calcium hardness value of 300 opposite the total alkalinity value of 90 on the watergram. Note, if the cyanuric acid CYA level exceeds 30 parts per million, the total alkalinity value must be adjusted using the following formula. Hold the calcium hardness and total alkalinity values where they are and turn the wheel until the arrow points to a pH value of 7.5 in the window. Find the water temperature which is located on the outer wheel. Note, if the temperature is not known, use 78 degrees Fahrenheit for pools or 104 degrees Fahrenheit for spas and hot tubs. In this example, we will assume the temperature is unknown and use 78 degrees Fahrenheit as our temperature value. The number opposite the temperature is the saturation index. The saturation index, 0, 0.0, indicates the water is balanced. Corrosive water. For this next demonstration, we will be using values that will give us a saturation index that indicates corrosive water. Set the calcium hardness value of 200 opposite the total alkalinity value of 50 on the watergram. Hold the calcium hardness and total alkalinity values where they are and turn the wheel until the arrow points to the pH value of 7.3. Find the water temperature of 80 degrees Fahrenheit. The saturation index is the number opposite the temperature. If the SI falls between two values, record the average, which is negative 0.6, indicating the water is corrosive. Scaling water. In this final demonstration, we will be using values that will give us a saturation index that indicates scaling water. Set the calcium hardness value of 300 opposite the total alkalinity value of 175 on the watergram. Hold the calcium hardness and the total alkalinity values where they are and turn the wheel until the arrow points to the pH value of 7.8. Find the water temperature of 80 degrees Fahrenheit. The saturation index shown, 0.6, indicates scaling water. Treatment tables for making any needed adjustments can be found in the back of Taylor's Pool and Spa Water Chemistry Booklet. Taylor's knowledgeable customer service representatives are available to provide technical assistance about our products. Call 800-TEST-KIT.